three, two, one. Curious about a career in plumbing, heating, cooling, or electrical? We have the answers for the top three most popular questions about working in the skilled trades. How do I become a licensed tradesperson? After earning your high school diploma or GED, the first step to becoming a licensed tradesperson begins with an apprenticeship. Apprenticeships last approximately four years with 8,000 hours of technical education combined with on-the-job training. This time-tested training system provides apprentices with in-depth knowledge and skills specific to their chosen career path. Another great benefit of being an apprentice is that you earn a wage while learning the trade. After completing your apprenticeship and successfully passing the licensure exam in your state, you'll be a licensed journeyman. In this role, you'll be running service calls by yourself. Depending on your chosen trade, your responsibilities as a journeyman include installing new home systems and repairing or maintaining existing ones, like a furnace or air conditioner, plumbing and gas lines, and electrical panels or fixtures. After working as a journeyman, a master's license is the highest level of certification a tradesperson can achieve. After completing additional training and passing an exam, a master tradesperson serves in more leadership roles. Along with coordinating projects with suppliers and permit offices, you'll be supervising journeymen and apprentices. How much money will I earn in the trades? The trades of plumbing, heating, cooling, and electrical can get you on the path to earning a great salary without the burden of student loan debt. When you start in the trades, you start on a path to opportunity. On average, the starting wage for an apprentice is between $13 and $17 an hour, and that continues to increase each year during the apprenticeship. As your experience grows, so does your earning potential. As a first-year journeyman technician, the average wage is approximately $25 an hour. As a licensed master tradesperson, you can expect to earn, on average, $35 an hour in your first year. In fact, it's not uncommon for technicians to earn a six-figure salary. The trades not only provide great pay, they also create a path for career growth. From management to small business ownership, these industries offer advancement that is hard to match. Do I need experience to start a career in the trades? The simple answer is no, as residential service companies throughout the country look to build their skilled workforce. Hiring managers are looking to hire for character, train for skill. Many companies hire employees for their character and then provide the technical training on the job, often during an apprenticeship. Technicians in the trades of plumbing, heating, cooling, and electrical work with homeowners every day. A technician with upstanding character will have long-term success in this industry. With a positive attitude, integrity, and excellent communication skills, these technicians are successful in working with homeowners to protect their most valuable asset, their home. So what are you waiting for? Get a jump start on your career and put your skills to work in your community as a plumber, HVAC technician, or electrician. To learn more about the trades, visit explorethetrades.org.